the virtual whiteboard. T V W. Welcome to the virtual whiteboard. Children, in the previous video, we actually did an activity with peanuts, right? For regrouping. We did the regrouping for addition. Today, let us learn in a different way. If we need to add 6 plus 5, imagine we have 6 bricks and 5 bricks. If we put these bricks one on top of each other, then we would get 11 bricks. 6 plus 5 is 11, right? Now, let us say we move a set of bricks on one side so that we have 10 bricks on one side. It is easy to make the set of 6 bricks into 10, right? So, we will borrow 4 bricks and move it to the side where we have 6 bricks. Let us move 4 bricks to the side where we have 6 bricks and let us make it 10. Now, we have 10 bricks plus 1 brick. Therefore, 10 plus 1 is equal to 11. Isn't this the same as adding 6 plus 5? Yes, we are just moving the bricks which means we are grouping the bricks into 10s and 1s. Therefore, 6 plus 5 is same as 10 plus 1 which is equal to 11. Let us take another example where we have 3 bricks on the left hand side and 8 bricks on the right hand side. How can we group? What is easy? Now, if we put the bricks on top of one another, we will get 11 bricks. Therefore, 3 plus 8 is equal to 11. But if we need to regroup into 10s, don't you think it is easier to add 2 bricks from the set of 3 to the 8? So, let us move 2 bricks to the right hand side. Then, we would get 1 plus 10, which is equal to 11. 1 plus 10 is 11. Now we can say that 3 plus 8 is the same as 1 plus 10 which is equal to 11. Now can you try these? If you want you can draw the bricks or you can do it in the mind. Let's see if you get the right answer. If you like this video please like subscribe and share. I will see you in the next video with more addition problems. Thank you.